Mangaji's channel is one of the fastest growing financial platforms on YouTube. While his content is incredibly insightful, what truly sets his videos apart is his distinctive and polished editing style. In this video, I'll walk you through some of the signature effects he frequently uses, effects you can easily replicate in Adobe Premiere Pro. One of his most recognizable elements is the animated grid background, which adds a modern and dynamic feel to his videos. The best part? It's incredibly easy to create. Once you've built it, you can customize the colors and reuse it across multiple projects with ease. First, go to your project panel and click on New Item to create a color mat. Choose a dark gray color, then drag the color mat into the timeline. Next, go to the Effects panel and search for Grid. Apply the grid effect to the color mat. Now head to the Effect Controls panel and change the size setting from Corner Point to Width Slider. Increase the width to around 255 or adjust based on your preference. Set the Blend Mode to Overlay and reduce the opacity to your liking. Now search for Ramp in the effects and apply it to the same color mat. Make sure the ramp shape is set to Linear Ramp and increase Blend with Original to around 90 or 100, depending on your taste. If you want to change the white color to another shade, go ahead and do it. Let's switch it to red for example. You can also adjust the ramp's position to create a different style. Play around with the blend with original value for more refined results. Once that's done, go back to the effects tab and search for noise. Apply the noise effect to the color mat and in the effect controls, increase the noise amount to around 4 or 5. You can disable the Use Color Noise option if you prefer a cleaner look. That's your final background. Iman uses several animations in his videos, and recreating each one manually would take a lot of time. That's where Envato Elements becomes a game changer. It provides an extensive collection of high-quality templates and video assets for every major editing software. With just one subscription, you'll unlock unlimited downloads of templates, ranging from transitions and openers to promos, titles, and much more. Envato Elements also provides a wide range of software for selecting templates. You'll also gain access to stock footage, music, sound effects, graphics, and other creative resources. Just download the template you like, drag and drop it into your project, and you're good to go. Save your time, effort, and money. So what are you waiting for? Click the link in the description to start your 7-day free trial of Envato Elements today. Another popular effect used by Iman is the wave distortion during animations. To create this, start by making a new adjustment layer and drag it onto your timeline. Go to the Effects panel, search for Turbulent Displace, and apply it to the Adjustment layer. In the Effect Controls, change the amount to 10 and the size to 40 or 50, based on your preference. Now create a keyframe for evolution at the start of your animation, and another at the end. Increase the evolution value to control the intensity of the wave effect. That's it, the wave animation is now ready to use. Iman often pairs this with a cinematic low frame rate. To achieve that look, search for Posterize Time in the Effects panel and apply it to the same adjustment layer. In the Effect Controls, change the frame rate to around 10 or 15, depending on how choppy or smooth you want the animation to feel. And just like that, you've recreated Iman Gaji's iconic animation style. That wraps up this tutorial. If you're interested in a more detailed guide on animating a character in Iman's style, drop a comment below. I'd love to hear your thoughts. Thanks for tuning in, and I'll catch you in the next video.